Last sunset here. This is one of the best beaches in the world. And all the snorkel gear is closed. All, like the whole thing is closed now. Found a place that finally had just rented snorkel gear. Oh my gosh. Look at oh this. Oh my gosh. Look at this ice. Needles apply a crash boat. Woohoo! We are here and it is now already starting off the vlog at 4 o'clock. 3. 3? 30. 3 30. My Apple Watch is apparently dead, so I don't really know. 3 30. 3 30. It took us to get over here, you guys. Oh Literally my. almost a four hour drive to come over here and it wasn't we had supposed some stops to be. in between. There was traffic. Somebody has the bladder of apparently one of our children. I drank a lot of water, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It is true, but we are here now. We are here now. Take a look at this. So we're just going to do a 360. Well, look at lot. this. Yes, this is just we, the parking lot. We need to go lot. down to like the actual spot down there. If the parking lot is this pretty, you know the beach is going to be amazing. And it better be because we heard this is one of the best beaches in the world and that's why we came to it. Yep. So we're happily surprised. Parking was free. Can yeah. start off better than that. Yep. We are going to go down. We just barely missed a massive main rainstorm. And we are now gonna go down and check out the beach. I'm hoping on our list today was supposed to be snorkeling. We're crossing our fingers, we can still get that yeah, done. Yeah, I would think so. You guys, it's gorgeous here. Crash boat! Crash boat right here. This is the, the pier for it. There's my smoker hot wifey right there. It's very cold. It's cold, but actually it's pretty warm. The yeah, water's warm. Relative. For the ocean? Yeah, the, the water's nice and warm. It's like it's like a cold bathtub. So we just drove two and a half hours, which took us actually, it was like three hours to get at here. Least. At least three hours. And all the snorkel gear is closed. All like the whole thing is closed now. So a little now, bit of a bummer. It's we're super big to bummer. Change our but, but it's okay. We're we're gonna make the best out of this. Oh my gosh! Look oh at this. my gosh! Look at this ice literally <laughs> swimming in the ocean when it's look pouring this, rain. Look at this rain. Oh my gosh. Oh. I don't even know what else to say. This is gorgeous. It's so cool. Oh. It is gorgeous. Like the rain droplets on the ocean with the, the Puerto Rico flag. It's this hot a lot. mama right here. It's amazing. It's also very salty. Yes, it's very salty. Woo. And hopefully you can see us over the, the rainy camera. What started off as not a great experience, I won't lie. I'm sure you could tell, you guys know us by now. It was rough there for a what solid are you talking about? couple hours. <laughs> Turned out to be a really good experience. Swimming in the ocean in the rain. It was really cool. It was magical. And if that's all we get done today, so be it. Yeah. Still been a great day. What started out as a horrible day ended actually really good. And maybe horrible is a little bit strong, but it was rough. You guys getting there, then having snorkeling closed, all the stops we had to make, it was just a long day. And so we're actually gonna combine yesterday's vlog with today's vlog so we have a little bit more footage for you guys. Don't wanna waste your time or hours. So today we are doing what we would be doing if we were back in Utah, which is going to church. And I'm actually really excited. It's just a branch here. So at home we have a ward, which basically means you have a lot of people that believe the same thing. Here's the branch. There's gonna be like maybe 20 people there. And I'm excited to go experience that. I, for one, have never had that before. So today is our last full day on the island. We're gonna to go to church, then ho head over to one of the beaches and try snorkeling for like the fourth time. I think we've told you guys we're going snorkeling every day. Hopefully we finally are today, but I'm not even getting my hopes up. So that is our plan for our last full day here on the island. I'm starting to get homesick. I miss my babies, but tomorrow, Tomorrow we head home. So we're gonna go get church clothes. We'll see you guys after church. Sure is different than the church that we go to in yeah. Idaho yeah. or Utah, I guess I should say. Always an Idaho girl at heart. JD just informed me that they probably will not have AC. I'm kind of dying. Found a place that finally had just rented snorkel gear. So we have it for the next couple hours and it is the most beautiful view. Look at that water, so clear. It is beautiful. So, we're looking forward to this time together. Yay. And it's just like this nice cozy little spot right here.
my virgin pina colada we've been looking for. One thing I've noticed about this island is that everything closes down really early. Like, I'm talking by 4.30, all of the shops are closed. By 7.30, I don't know, everybody's still on the road, but like, everything closes down really early. Probably because it's not peak season. This is starting back into peak season. So maybe that's why. Maybe they're open later during peak season. But for now, if you don't get your pina colada by two in the afternoon, you're not getting it. We've learned that the hard way. We're, we're, we've, been. we've learned that the hard way. Oh, yummy. Last sunset here. Look at this sunset from our freaking place. Look at our place. Look at this sunset. Oh. We're gonna miss you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fast. Well, it's a video. Did you see me? <laughs> hey guys. Just keep talking. Uh, so we, Michelle, have the best uh, restaurant here. It's only like 10 minutes away from where we're staying. Awesome. We got queso dip coming, queso. Queso dip. dip coming. So it's um, kind of like a Americanized Mexican place probably. Would you say? Actually, I don't even know if it's too Americanized. That might be me portraying that. But I'm actually really excited to try it. And I'm excited we're not driving an hour to get to there. We were going to go drive an hour and I was like, Feel bad if I come up with a plan B. Oh my gosh. I've never seen cheese dip that's just actual melted mozzarella. There's like that and butter. That is all that is in this cheese dip. We are gonna have such a bad stomach ache tonight. Probably. It's worth it. Totally Our last night in paradise is officially coming to a close. My gosh, it's been a, such a good couple days. We don't want to go home. We are really enjoying it here, but we do miss our babies. We just got off the phone with Peyton and, and it just broke our hearts. We just wanted to see her, hold her, and be there with them. Uh, but we'll get to do that tomorrow night. So uh, we got to pack up early, early in the morning, get out of here by 11, get to San Juan and enjoy some of the stuff there, maybe get some souvenirs. And then we got to catch our flight, which leaves at about 4.30 and we get into Salt Lake at like 11.30ish. And then we got to drive, you know, 40 minutes to our house. So it's going to be a crazy day of traveling. Um, today was awesome. Today was really, was really a great day. We, we went and did snorkeling and just sat at the beach. We had an awesome dinner like we showed you guys and it was just it, overall it was a really good day a really good way to finish out our our trip so thank you guys for watching we're gonna be traveling tomorrow and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow thanks for watching guys bye